Hello YouTubers. I recently made an astounding discovery that will surely thrill all of you Nexus 7 and Angry Bird lovers. I'm sure you guys were as disappointed as I was to find out that Angry Birds Go is not available or not compatible with the Nexus 7. And you can see that if you go into their store, I had already googled it previously, and you click on it, it'll open in the Google Play Store and it will give you this message up here that says it is not compatible right here this device isn't compatible with this version of Angry Birds Go and that was pretty sad for me as well as the kiddos because we love Angry Birds and we were really anxious to play it but I recently found a very easy way to get Angry Birds Go on your Nexus 7 anyway and it's very easy and it works nicely. The, what you have to do is you have to install it through the Amazon App Store which I have installed on my device right here. If you don't have it installed see my other video on how to install the Amazon App Store on your Nexus 7 device. The first thing that you need to do even before you go into the App Store is you need to go into your settings into the security menu and click on this little button right here that says unknown sources it says allow installation of apps from sources other than the Play Store make sure that is clicked it'll give you a little warning message here you press OK the apps from the Amazon App Store are safe and then you open your Amazon App Store you press the search button you begin to press Angry Birds Go and as you can see it's already appeared up here at the top you click on the free get app it will download and then you press in next look at your permissions install it will install to your device now as it's installing I would like to kind of throw a little side note out there I have this installed on my other device and it is a little bit laggy at times and that could be the reason that they didn't make it available on the Nexus 7 but as you'll see this workaround it works quite nicely and the lag is only periodic it's not all the time you still have really good functionality on the game and it's a lot of fun so it should be done installing here any second now also one thing that I noticed when you open the game for the first time at least on my other device it did give me an error so all I did is I exited out of there and reopened the app and it worked again nicely. So we will see at this time if we run into that same problem here as soon as this game installs. Okay, it's installed now. I'll press open. I don't know if you can read this but at the beginning it said calculating upload and then it just changed to installing update and then finally it popped up here <laughs> angry birds go now when I install this on my other device this is where I got the error so if you guys get an error here you just press ok and cancel out of it and you will want to open the game back up and everything should work nicely. And there you have it. There's Angry Birds Go. So now we'll just go in and play real quick so you guys can see a level, what it looks like. It's pretty much like any other racing game except for there's no speeding up it's all like a downhill go-kart race it's pretty fun my kids and I have enjoyed it very much so you can
choose whether you want to steer by tilting or touching. Of course, on a tablet you want to tilt it. Kind of defeats the purpose otherwise. And so you just go down through the level like this and you have fun. See how it's stalling on me a little bit? It doesn't usually do that. Hopefully once we get rolling it will stop. And there we go, there's the first level. Alrighty guys, there you have it. There's Angry Birds Go on a Nexus 7 tablet. I hope you guys enjoy. If you like this video, please press the like button and subscribe to my channel. I'd appreciate it a whole bunch.